just give you the thrilling climax. Everyone loves the thrilling climax. Epic conclusion. So yeah, for, pretend you saw all that plot development and character growth and all that. We're just going to give you the daylight exposition. Yeah. The end of the favorite play that we've never actually done. A play affectionately called It All Makes Sense Now. <laughs> Are you saying that it does not look like that you, Fabrizio, have kidnapped Isabella, the woman that I, Capitano Testosterone, have been arranged to marry? Hey, and you, Fabrizio, have not kidnapped my daughter, Isabella. And that you, Fabrizio, have not kidnapped Isabella, the woman I love? Oh, no, it's not like that at all. Because I am Isabella. <gasps> I disguised myself as a man to escape the arranged marriage between myself and you, Capitano. By, that was arranged by you, my father, Pantalone. It was profitable. But it was not for love. So I wanted to disguise myself as a man to escape, to, to run out of town and elope with my true love, Orazio. You see? It all makes sense now! Wait! There is something that does not make sense now to the Capitano. There is? There is. You say the name Fabrizio? Yes! That name is not unknown to Capitano. For you see, I have not always been known by the name of Capitano Poco Blanco Frappuccino El Grande! Testosterone. You have it? For you see, but I was just a wee babe, just a tiny, still manly babe. I had another name, and that name is the only thing I had that connects me. For when I was young, I was kidnapped, stolen, taken from my family by pirates. Pirates? Pirates, pirates most foul. And the only thing I had to connect to me, to the life I left behind, the family who loved me, was a blanket. This baby blanket that I was wrapped in and stitched on the blanket with a name, one name, my name, the name Fabrizio. Fabrizio? What a strange coincidence. What can it possibly mean? I don't know. I can't imagine. This is, this is reminding me of a, of a memory of my past. For when I was younger, yes I was younger, when I was younger, I had a son. A son? A son. I had a brother? Yes. And yes, and my son was, was taken from me. Taken from me by pirates. Pirates? Pirates was foul. And on that fateful night when he was taken, I had him bundled in a baby blanket. Oh, how sweet. And on that blanket, I had the name stitched. Fabrizio! Fabrizio? But that would mean you see? that you're... That you were the baby in the blank. You're my little son. Oh, my mom was bad to love you. My mom was bad to love you. Oh, my mom was And my sister, my... My, my sister. sister! I almost married my sister! But you can't oh. marry your sister! I can't marry my sister! But if I'm your sister and you're my brother, then that means we're related, and that means we can't get married, and that means we can get married! Of course! It all makes sense now! Although, Although Isabella, if, if we're going to get married, I need to come clean about something. What's wrong, my love? You see, Orazio wasn't my birth name. It wasn't? No, you see, years ago, when I was just a baby, I was stolen. Taken away from my true parents by pirates. Pirates! Pirates most foul. They left me somewhere in the countryside. The only clue I had to my true identity was the blanket that I was wrapped in. A blanket that had been stitched with my name. My true name. Fabrizio. Fabrizio? Fabrizio. I know how this feels. But, 
but this is reminding me of something else that I that I haven't talked about in a very long time. Something else? Else? What is it? I had not just one son. What? But I had two. I have a baby brother? I have a second brother? And I have no idea what's going on. <laughs> and that son, my second son, he was taken from me on that same horrible fateful night by pirates. Pirates? Pirates most foul. Oh, those pirates shook it around. And my second son was also wrapped in a blanket. Oh. How sweet of you. And I was stitched on the blanket the name for pretty old. Fabrizio? Wait. So we invoke it. You would name both your sons Fabrizio? Well, you see, when the loom is set up to stitch in there, and there's a set up fee for the loom. So I said, well, would you waive the fee if you used the same name twice? So they did. So I used the same name twice, and it was cheaper that way. How very oh. approval of you, Father. Okay, that all makes sense now. <laughs> but that so, means you are my other son. Father! Wait, that means you! My, my brother! My brother! My baby brother! My baby brother! Meet our sister! Because there is something else. Oh, something else? Oh, Lord. You've got to be joking! That I haven't told anyone in a very, very, very long time. You need to get out of the and talk to people. <laughs> you see, yeah, um, you do, Father. Get it over with. On the same night when both of my dear sons were taken from me by pirates. Pirates? Pirates most foul. Those pirates were awful busy. I I came out of, of my of my home and on my doorstep bundled in a, in a pirate flag was a little girl. And so I took this little girl in into my home and into my heart and raised her as my own. And you see. You were that little girl who was wrapped in this Wait, pirate flag. It, I, I'm adopted? You are I'm adopted. I'm a pirate star? And you are not related to either of my two sons. I'm not our sister. We're not related my to my sister. My brother. That means I can marry her. We can get married. Wait, but that means I'm not related. Oh, look at my baby brother's face. Look at that face. And you don't know you can get it. Go, go. I love a baby brother. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Father, yes. father, may we have your blessing, both okay. of us? Please, yes, please, Father. Go and be happy. Oh, with my thank blessing. goodness. Let's tell them, let's elope before something else. Oh, like time the coincidental happens. So, uh, Papa Pantalone, I'm going to take a pizza, please. I just have <laughs> one, one final question. So now that your long lost private son, Fabrizio Orazio, you're going to be marrying your adopted by the daughter, Fabrizio Isabella. Does this mean that you're going to pay both the right price and the dowry to yourself? You know, now that you mention it, uh, yes. <laughs> yes, it does. It's almost like I am um, brand new guy. Wait. <laughs> of course, it's, uh, it all makes sense now. <laughs> Gavin Donald does not get married, but uh, it's the last night of mid round 50 here, and uh, sometimes being an eligible Spanish captain is uh, very useful. But before all that, even if you Thank you, everyone, for letting us entertain you for several minutes. On this, this stage, stage right, right here at this right moment. now. I'd like to introduce the next actors who's ever willing to come up here and perform next because there's not really a schedule. Because open mic night is 